Omaha will be named after an LGBTQ plus activist. A portion of Taylor Street from 25th Street to 25th Avenue will honor Dominique Morgan. She tells me a big piece of her will always be in Omaha. 25th and Taylor, which will soon be named Dominique Morgan Street, sets the scene for only the beginning of her story. I went into the juvenile system at the age of 12, and that's the same street I was put into a cop car for, for the first time. Morgan says she wasn't arrested for a crime when this happened, but her parents sent her to get emotional and mental help. As a child, Morgan says she struggled with behavioral problems and had undiagnosed ADHD. It was their last ditch effort to try to figure out like what's happening with our child. I, on the other hand, didn't have language for what I was struggling with, my gender identity, my sexual orientation. By 18, she was arrested for what's often called survival crimes. I would steal cars and sleep with them. So I was homeless from like the age of 17 to 18. Morgan served nearly 10 years in prison, 18 months of those in solitary confinement. By 2009, she got out of prison with an associate's degree in culinary management. Surround yourself with people who are deeply invested in you being great. From there, Morgan served in a variety of positions, from being an adolescent health educator for Charles Drew to the first black president of Heartland Pride and the executive director of Black and Pink, an organization that can provide housing and helps formerly incarcerated LGBTQ plus people. You just got to grind. You have to defy any sort of expectation people make for you. It's a message Morgan hopes reaches people who are still in the prison system. They will always try to make you feel like wherever your story is, that's where it has to end. Since 2020, Morgan has lived her life as a black transgender woman. And even after moving to Atlanta one year ago, she says her work to uplift the community she calls home will never stop. No matter where I live, I owe young people in Nebraska my time. I owe them my work. I owe them my presence. Omaha City Council members approved the change. The street naming ceremony is set for Monday afternoon at 1.